Good day. You are looking at a Bosch Digital Congress network known as a DCN system set up on the bench for checking prior to being installed in a council chamber. We have 14 units connected to the central control unit by wire and there are a couple of wireless units connected via the wireless access point. The wireless units have a battery which when it's plugged into the battery charger there can be charged up and it takes about three hours to charge the battery enough for 20 hours of talk time. When you have so many microphones next to so many loudspeakers, the expectation would be that when you turned on the microphone, you'd get feedback. The Bosch DCN system has facilities for connecting a feedback suppressor into the circuit. So, if you turn on the microphone and then activate the feedback suppressor, the feedback goes away, but people can still hear clearly what is being said. While those sitting around the council chamber can hear what's being said through the little loudspeakers in their individual units, those sitting in the public gallery can hear through loudspeakers pointed at that area, and for those who are very hard of hearing, you can connect a hearing loop which they can hear through their deaf aids. With an ageing population in Australia, hearing clearly what is being said at public meetings is becoming more and more difficult for more people. The Bosch DCN system allows those speaking to be heard more clearly by those listening with nobody having to strain, either in speaking or in listening. Now we'll go and set it up in the council chamber at Hobson's Bay. As you can see, the microphones are spaced a lot further apart than they were during the testing setup, and the equipment is put away in a cupboard inside the rack. The equipment in the rack includes the battery charger, the feedback suppressor, the recorder, the central control unit that has all the microphones connected to it, except for the wireless microphones which go via a wireless access point which is all hidden away, and there is the mixer and amplifier sending sound to the public gallery. We're now going to put the camera at the back of the gallery where the public sit. First of all, I'll take off the lapel mic. I'm now speaking with the camera at the back of the public gallery, and the microphone is sitting on top of the camera in about the same position as a person would be sitting listening to the council meeting from the public gallery. This is the sound that you're hearing from my natural voice. The air conditioning and any other ambient sounds are mixed with the sound of my voice. If I turn on the microphone, then the sound for the people in the public gallery and those around the council chamber become a lot clearer. It's easier for the people to hear. It's also easier and less strain on the person speaking. For further details and a demonstration in your meeting area, please contact me on 02 9449 9677 or on my mobile 0418 22 0016. Have a good day. Mm -hmm.